What's up, everybody? We got Dev Patel's directorial debut, which he also starred in Monkey Man this weekend, and he did not hold back at all his first time in the director's chair. There will be some spoilers here in my review for the movie, so you've been warned. Now let's get into it. I'll go ahead and get my cons out of the way first here, and I've only got two of them because this was a damn good movie. First thing is the pacing of this movie. Well, well, it was only a, a, a minute over the two hour mark, the runtime that is. I found myself checking my watch about 45 minutes to an hour into the movie as the front half is very light on the action and it's rather slow. Then, the only other thing I didn't like about the movie was the supporting cast. Unfortunately, outside of Dev Patel, who was great in front of and behind the camera, there wasn't much to celebrate when it comes to performances in this movie. But let's move on to my pros section for the movie because, like I said, this was a damn good movie. Kicking this section off is going to be the action sequences in the movie, and if I didn't know this was Dev's first time directing, I sure as hell wouldn't have been able to tell because he did a phenomenal job and so did the choreographer. Once the fights start coming in the movie, it elevates the flick to a whole other level. I mean, everything, from the staircase fight to the fight in the hooker hotspot to the one in the kitchen that leads into the big final fight, everything was amazing. Next up is just a story. This wasn't your typical action movie, you know, that's kind of soulless and you're in it for the fun and not to pick on a, a franchise I like, but you know, your Expendables movies, the, the ones where you're leaving the theater thinking about the action sequences and not at all about the plot. This was not one of those in credits to Dev Patel, Paul Angu and Noah, <laughs> Angu and Noella, who I know I meant to pronounce his name, and John Colley for a job well done. Then kind of circling back to the action sequences, something that elevated them from great to holy fucking shitballs was both the soundtrack and the score of the movie. Both were perfect, used at perfect times, I was a big fan. Finally, giving major props to Dev Patel one last time because the visuals in this movie were absolutely stunning. I mean, I tried to find as many as I could to get in this video, but the two I got that stood out to me in the theater were the one where he comes out of the elevator into the red room and when he's walking around the casino or the club in the purple lighting simply great shots by the rookie director and so that'll do it for my review of dev patel's monkey man a great start to his directorial career and just a great action movie in general as it's going to land at an 8 out of 10 for me personally let me know what you thought of the movie though down in the comments below and make sure you have a great day